What is a pictograph? Any guesses? Common sense tells you that a pictograph must be some kind of picture. Yes, a pictograph is basically a way to represent data with pictures that relate to the data. The pictures provide a way to compare numbers in different categories quickly. Take a look. Percy makes dog treats every day to give to a dog rescue and shelter place. This pictograph shows how many dog treats he baked each day in the past week. You can easily see that on Sunday, the largest number of treats were baked. A graph has several labels. These labels are important as they give important information about what is being shown. The title gives a short explanation of what information is focused on in the pictograph. This identifies what you are looking at. It can be creative or simple, as long as it tells you what the graph is about. The title of this graph tells you that it is about the number of dog treats baked by Percy. The categories tell you the specific type of data. In this pictograph, the data is based on the days of the week. Those are the categories. The key, or legend, shows you the symbol and the scale. What is the value of each symbol? In this pictograph, the symbol is the dog bone. Each dog bone represents four dog treats. The data is shown in the symbols. Pictographs can be drawn vertically as well. The pictures in a vertical graph go up and down instead of across, but they still have the same parts. A title that tells what the pictograph is about. Categories that tell what data was collected. A key or legend that shows the symbol and the scale and the data that shows how many of each item. How do we read the data? We count by the number given on the scale. Take a look. To count how many treats were eaten on Monday, we can count by fours, because each dog bone treat counts as four. So we can see that 16 treats were baked on Monday. Or we can multiply the number of dog bone symbols, four, by the value of each bone, four, and we'll get the same number, 16. Sunday is a bit trickier. There are five full symbols and one half symbol. Since one symbol has a value of four, a half symbol has a value of two. We can multiply five times four, which equals 20. Then we can add the two from the half bone symbol. And we can see that on Sunday, Percy baked 22 treats. In summary, pictographs can be horizontal, pictographs can be vertical, and either way that they're drawn, they will have a title, categories, a key or legend, and the data. Now you understand what a pictograph is, what labels are required, and how to read them. Thank you for watching.